That's the volume thermometer. That's all explained. James says, is there an, if there's an ultra-high volume down bar at new lows and the next bar is up on low volume, does that still mean the down bar was buying? If, you've taken, if you're at new lows, James, and you see ultra-high volume on a down bar with the next bar up, you have to wait. You wait for a test to see if the genuine buying is actually there. And the test is a low volume down bar into that big high volume up bar, uh, down bar, sorry. So basically, I, I'll try and show you that on Apple. I can show you that in a minute on a, on a stop. I can actually show you what I'm talking about. So just bear with me on that. Uh, great job, Gab, as always. Give Olivia a big hug. Thanks, Michael. Cheers, mate. Thanks very much. Michael was at a seminar here in Chicago a few weeks ago. Guys, just so you know, I just want to make an announcement now. I, I've just had a meeting this morning with the Chicago Mercantile Exchange. I'm delighted to tell you that we will be doing a live trading event at the CME on the 30th and 31st of July. And it will be in the CME building. There will be a tour of the floor. We will be trading live with the educators. I'll be with a guy called uh, Marcus Heitaker, who's a great trade, campus trader, and Robert Hoffman. The, their places will be limited. I'm going to give you Brittany's number. Um, we haven't got a price on it yet, but it will be very reasonable, as you all know who are our customers. Um, if you want to put your name down and register, um, I will obviously make sure that we get a, a waiting list. I know there's going to be a lot of people interested. I'll give you Brittany's details in a minute. Okay. Brendan says, can you provide your entry and exit points? Yeah, I can. Yeah, I'll go for it again. This was the software telling us there was no demand, and it was followed by several red diamonds. I, I couldn't get an entry in here because I was chasing the market, so I didn't. It kept falling to here, and then I got a high volume up bar followed by a perfect entry. That's where I took my first entry on two contracts. Remember, I was, a, I was only trading one contract originally. I was $150 down, so actually I was already um, three points down for that, for that one contract. So I had to make that up. So I took the short here, Market confirmed the weakness. It came back down to here. Okay, As it touched the low of that bar, I took a contract off, wiped out my loss. Then it came back up. I, added, I got back into the market here with an, another position. It came back off. Then it came back up to here. I let the contract run. And then here, as this green diamond, you'll see me call out, I've exited my position. As I exited the position, it pushed up to 906, came back down. It then closed on the low. After this weakness, that was a very weak bar. I re-entered with a contract, and I rode that down to 900.75, where I exited the trade, and you can see why, because it's just gone sideways. There's the two white diamonds. That's exactly how that panned out, and you can go back and check that on the recording. It's exactly, exactly how it happened. The three high-volume up bars on the right-hand side. Do you mean this here, Lully? Is that what you're talking about? Can I explain the significance of those? Just confirm, is that what you're asking? So smart, yeah, okay. No, Chris, um, on this account that I've just shown you, the, uh, the profit on that account that I trade publicly live was $275. My risk, um, in fact, I was $150 down. Let's just be clear, when we trade a public account, Okay, I want to trade a small account size so you can all see that you can trade small account size and make profit. That's the reason, Chris, I use a small account. I don't discuss the other accounts we trade because it's irrelevant. But I do like to show people that when we're calling a trade, we're trading it live with a real account. Okay, Chris? That's the only reason that we actually show an account. So you can see that we're analyzing the chart, taking a position, but will we taking other positions? Yes. Um, Gavin, can you please? Yes, okay, absolutely. Um, that's a pleasure, Ken. Yeah, we do, Andrew. We've got a whole load of trading material that's coming out next week. Yeah, John, good to meet you. Now, all the people from Dallas who are here, this is how it works, okay? You've just seen it live. Just as I showed you, in hindsight, on Sunday in Dallas, I was down there with a great seminar down there, 200 of you uh, at the Dallas AFTER uh, Association, which is the Association for Technical Analysis in Dallas, Texas. Great pleasure to be with you all, and um, you know, really enjoyed it. Uh, most importantly, though, I think uh, we were seeing some stuff there in hindsight 
And now, as I promised you, we are seeing it in foresight. Yet, Lalit's asking about these bars here. This is a two-bar reversal. Uh, what I know is going to act as support. Look at the trend clusters below me. And I actually came out the position, and, and you can see why now, OK? Because um, it's now gone up against me. It's bounced off 900, which I knew was support. You've got to trade with support and resistance. Now, Chris, my profit target, I don't set a profit target for the day. But basically, if I make... If, the, if I don't give any money to the markets, I've had a good day. If I make $1,000 on a day, on a small account, it's a superb day. An average day for me on, a, on that 7,500 account would be about $275 a day when I trade it live. I don't, it depends. Uh, this morning, um, I was trading a different account, and we got a similar type of setup. Great. Byron, well done. That's great. Uh, Ken says, how much was at risk? Um, I actually risked on that $150, which is actually what, what the risk was, okay, just so you know. Yeah, I will take a quick look at Forex for you. Okay, Dave, I'll see you in the seminar. Okay, Tom, that's fine, I understand. Then contact the office, speak to Brittany. I'll put a number up in a minute, and she can arrange a demo for you. Um, you've purchased your copy, says John. Great stuff. Yes, Ash, the new training modules will be available in the uh, members area. Some of them are chargeable, some of them are not. Please explain what the mentorship program is about. Joe, um, I'm going to give you the phone number of Brittany in the office because I've got a mentorship program starting right now that I've got to go to. Okay. Thanks, Brendan. Good, I'm glad you enjoyed it. Said the trading was outstanding. Well, the most important thing, is it logical? Does it make sense to you? Can you see how the Trade Guider program analyzes it? Now, for those of you... That I've got lots of questions coming in here that I'm not going to be able to answer all of them. Let me um, very quickly. Okay, this is where if you want to find out more, and I know a lot of you do, or you want to register for the um, event coming up in July, there's no, we don't know what the fee is yet, but it's going to be very reasonable. It's a two-day event at the Chicago Mercantile Exchange. Contact Brittany. The phone's going to go off the hook. I know that. Okay, if you want to order the CD, it's got a very special offer on there that I cannot reveal publicly, but there's only 50 CDs left uh, because we used that particular offer at the Dallas after event, and there was uh, there's five days or six days left of the offer, so we are making that available to potential customers in this room. If you're a customer of Trade Guider, don't ring for the CD. You're going to get access to some of the material that's on there anyway. Most of it you've already seen. It's actually more... Um, there's a little bit of educational stuff on there, but there's also some access there to the various trading rooms that we're doing. Um, we are starting a brand new series of rooms in June. We will be emailing that out next week, which includes a live e-mini trading room, which will be running on a regular basis, and a Forex room. Um, I'm sorry I haven't been able to look at the, uh, the Forex markets here. Um, I had to trade what I see, but I will do another event shortly. Uh, for all of you, um, because I know you enjoy these, and I'll do Forex, and I'll try and do it one evening this week when the uh, Japanese yen is moving, because I think the yen, just so you know, um, the yen is my big trade for, the, for, the, for this next week to two weeks, Japanese yen versus the US dollar. I think that's the one that's going to really move for those of you that are Forex traders, and I will explain it in more detail. Okay, I've got to close this room down now. I'm sorry, but take Brittany's number. Give her a call. If you want the CD... She'll, just, she'll ask for your name and address and uh, your telephone number. If you want to book a demo, a one-to-one -one demo, we do do those. We're a bit booked up at the moment. We're about two weeks behind, but we will arrange that for you. And if you are in Dallas and you're after and you want to order the program at the special rate, ring Brittany and she will expedite your order because we are getting backed up. We had 15 orders already from everybody that was in Dallas already, and that's before today's event. So please, please, if you want to order at that special price, um, which I can't discuss publicly, and I won't because people watch this uh, um, video, but ring Brittany or contact Brittany for the CD, and we'll send it to you with our compliments in the post. Okay? Um, all right. There's so many questions coming in. I'm not going to get them all in because I've got to... Uh... That's a pleasure, everybody. Listen, I wish you all well. Sorry I've got to run, but I do have another commitment, which is the mentorship room. Um, God bless you all. Thank you for listening today. A great session. I think we, we, we took a losing trade at the beginning, and then we took two winning trades at the end there. Made our money up. That's the key to trading. Take profit from the market when it gives you 
be grateful for it, don't be greedy, don't overtrade, and if you do miss a move, don't worry about it. There'll be others, as we saw from Trade Guider today. Thanks, everyone. Have a really good uh, afternoon, and I wish you good trading. I will do another public seminar in the next week. Um, nearly 400 of you attended today, so thank you. God bless, and uh, goodbye.